Hello and welcome back to James Propmaker channel. So today I just want to give a little update on what's happening with the Brum project. Now this has been probably about eight months now in the making of me trying to figure out how I can build this Brum. Also um, a few people sadly passed away who did Brum originally so I cannot contact them. But this is just an update video. So, first of all, I said I was going to build Brum's grill, which I'm still going to do. I've sourced some plasticine, because I'm going to make them out of plasticine first, and then fiberglass over the top. And I managed to find a company that will upscale Brum's measurements. Let's quick glance at that, it's got one of the measurements on there. So that's going to be happening. So they're going to be printing out Brown's grill, they can do the whole car. I asked them to do the whole car, they can do that, no problem for me to use as a template. But for now, I just want them to do the grill so that I can use that as a template and then I can plasticine over it and sculpt it and then I can fiberglass over it. So that is what's going to be happening. At the minute, I am building Duck from Rosie and Jim from the very early 90s, some of you will know that. But um, Duck was part of Rosie and Jim, they lived on a narrow boat and they went all across the country on the river canals. So that's, if you want to see that video, I have hopefully, if I got this right, added the link above my head, hopefully. Also, you're all welcome to join the unofficial Brum group as well over on Facebook. Um, we have five original members from Brum who worked on it originally. Some of them was the special effects. Uh, some of them were camera assistants and camera men and women. So that is great. Um, what else? Yes, well you, you can see photos like this on the channel. Now as you just saw, Brum doesn't look very good there, does he? Well in one of the episodes, it was the Cake Gang episode I think it was, where Brum had to do a stunt we had to go up the ramps, that was um, the skip there, and Brum had to go up. Well, in reality, it didn't really work, did it? He just went up and poof, straight down in. But don't be sorry, because it was only a stunt Brum. It won't be the Hero Brum, because the Hero Brum cost thousands, absolutely thousands to build. So, it was a stunt Brum, which you could probably see at Boston on the Water Motor Museum. Um, also, I'd like to thank you to my sponsor as well. Um, my sponsors originally uh, sponsored my my fiance's combat robot um, Team Griffo with electronic speed controllers. Also on this project, my fiance will be involved as well. She's going to be the other half of the puppeteer for Brum. Probably going to be taking it in turns. So she does the driving. I can do the the mirrors and. Um, air suspension and stuff like that. Mirrors? No. Doors, you know. Um, well, I could show you a few photos of the thing. There's only a couple. There's one. These are his um, hero shots. That when they did the measurements for Brum, just what photos they took. There you go. Also, um, I just would like to say that um, I'm getting a few people contact me saying, Can you build me a Brum? Well, I'm sorry I can't build you a Brum, this is going to be a one-off and one-off only. The main reason I'm building this Brum is for me, because I've always loved Brum, hence why, also you, hence why you're also watching this. But also I'm building them to help raise money for charity as well, so that's the main purpose. So, I cannot build you Brum, uh, so that's that, so I'm sorry, but one of, well, one of it, I, I don't have enough time, I've only got enough time to do this. So it's only going to be one Brum and that's it. 
unless the film company contacts me, but I doubt it. So yeah, um, just like to say thank you to all my uh, new subscribers as well. It really means a lot. I have had, I think, 11 new subscribers. So thank you very much. Also, if you want to speed things along with this, you can um, become a Patreon for my channel, which will obviously speed things along. It helps stuff by like this, so this is like silicone. That's for the Duck Project actually, the silicone. That's what a Patreon will help go towards. Um, what else can I say? Um, yeah, so once I've done the grill, oh, that's it. Once I've reached a thousand subscribers, I will build another grill. It's going to be a one-off, one-off only. I'm going to build another grill. I'm going to do a live stream, like question and answers for a live stream. And I'm going to be giving away one of Brum's grills. It's going to be really rough. It's not going to be painted. It's just going to be fiberglass, trimmed, sanded a little bit. I might even screw like a little hook on top of the grill so then you can put them wherever you want, you can put them on your wall, door, wherever you would like. So yeah, once I've hit a thousand subscribers, I will do a live stream and your donation with like the super chat over on YouTube, your name will be entered in the um, live draw and um, I'll write them down as I go along, but then, anyway, the winner wins it. So yeah, I'll be giving away one of Brum's grills. So. Become a subscriber, once I've reached a thousand subscribers, I will be doing that. So yes, um, please stay tuned on my channel, I have other things coming up, like part two of the Rosie and Jim duck build, I've almost finished the mould, ready for it to be um, siliconed, then resins, then I've got to add a few RC equipment to him, so that will be coming up very soon. And also I'd like to build a Pinky and Perky um, Ventriloquist Puppet. I've always wanted to build a puppet, like a Ventriloquist one. So that'll be coming up in the upcoming months. I know it's pretty downtime at the minute, the way the world is going on right now. So I know it's very low at the minute. So be positive, we can get through this. So thank you for watching. I shall see you again very soon.